Good morning, my name's Steve, VK3 Cannibal Tea. And today's a short video to explain to you my 40 metre vertical delta loop. This antenna is 43.7 metres long for the 40 metre section and it has a 20 metre long parasitic element that enables it to work on 80 metres. Now the 80 metre element is a pink line here if you can see it going up into this tree it goes around there and you might just be able to see the um, it going across into that tree not very high probably five or six metres off the ground but this works really quite well f to get you on the band for 80 metres now we'll turn around so this is my feed point there's a four to one ballon in there I've put it in the box because it's a long term antenna I just want to protect everything that's how I've got the strain relief on the using the conduit. This has worked quite well. This is just a pole put into a star picket in the ground. Fed with a, a RG213 coax. And yeah, and I also have a choke balance at the bottom there to stop any common mode currents coming out. Right, so follow this along. If you look up the top there, see the peak of the loop. That's about 10 metres. Uh, sorry. 11 to 12 metres high. Got a couple of other antennas there. There's a, an 80 metre dipole on the top there for a second 80 metre antenna and a 160 metre inverted L. So it comes down here and it walks along. So if you notice the height, so probably at this point 1.2 metres, but sometimes if it's tighter it'll get, get up to uh, 1.5 metres. It's down the side of the house. And then I use this section here. Note, I'm using uh, cable ties to hold it off. This gives it a breaking point if the winds get really, really high. I always prefer to use cable ties because I just find them. So you're not going to pull anything down at the same time. And then it just comes into a pile that I bolt into a flower bed. Not perfect, not great, but it's pretty good. So this is it. Very, very good, simple antenna. 43.7 metres long. And, uh, yeah. Snuck down the side of my house. Um, give you an idea, I'm 40 metres. Um, I've worked about 240 countries. Uh, probably about 140 of them in sideband. Probably 140 or 50 of them in CW and a lot in FTA as well. But, so it works on all bands. This antenna works really well on uh, 40 metres. Works okay on 20 metres, 15 metres. It works really good on 10 metres. It's almost omnidirectional. And it works on 6 metres. 80 metres is great. Um, especially for local stuff. DXing, it will work. <laughs> Look, it's, it's not my other dipole's not always plugged in. So if I just need a quick set to someone on 80 metres, it works fine. You know, just in terms Anywhere. I can work ZL from here because I'm in Melbourne, uh, Sydney, Queensland, all around the country. A really, really handy antenna. So this just sort of gives you an idea of what can be done. 43.7 metres long with a 20 metre parasitic element. This is not fed with a, a quarter wave of coax. I found it better to be fed with the uh, ballon. And it just performs. It's my go-to antenna. It's where I'm on, uh, it's resonant at about 3.6 on 80 metres, um, about 7100, um, or mainly around the FT8 frequencies, but we'll say up a little bit more from that. Um, 20 metres, it's around this SSV portion, 15 metres, it's around the middle of the band, so 250, 21, 250, 10 metres around 28,490, um, yeah, 6 metres around 50,110. So, worth a look. Pretty stealth, the only thing is the issue is the, uh, it's all right, all right. Um, it does tune on 17, um, it will tune on 30, but you need a pretty good tune, so the big tune doesn't always do it. And uh, 12 means it does well, tune up on quite easily as well, so covers all the bands. A great single antenna, works really well, has a really good angle of radiation, especially on 40. So, yeah, all right, 73s, have fun. I hope you've enjoyed my 40 meter delta loop. And, uh, you try one. You can run these horizontal, they're fine if you don't have, if you have problems getting stuff up that high. You just won't get the DX performance that I'm getting. And the signals will be down a little bit. 
I also have at home, I have a, a three element Step IR. Step IR has a 40 metre dipole. I'm going to be honest with you, the Step IR is 2S points better than the Delta Loop. But before I had the Step IR, I had the Delta Loop, I didn't have anything else. So. Um, <laughs> it, it is what it is, so it works great. I recommend, highly recommend them to anyone who's got room to put up an antenna like this. Seven threes from Steve, VK3, Catapult T. If you like the video, please have a look at some of my others, like, share and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thank you.